We are in Waco at a place called the Waco Mammoth Museum or the Mammoth Dig. It's an actual live archaeological dig. There's a mammoth and mammoth bones and a bunch of stuff inside. It's actually amazing. So go ahead, check this out. Thanks. Okay, this is the uh, structure that they've built over the dig. Big mammoth. Okay. This is the actual dig, an actual live archaeological dig going on in real time. This is, looks like the pelvis and the femur bones and the horns or whatever they're called, the tusks of the mammoth. Look at the detail of this. Absolutely amazing. Okay, there's an archaeologist person in there actually digging in real time. Yep. Using little scrapers, little blowers. Okay, we got this. Okay. Mammoth tusks. Mammoth bones. another layer here so okay hold on a second look at that that's the jaw of something okay and then over here you can see how they've dug into the ground this is solid rock and then we got two more people right here And then you got some more stuff here. Absolutely amazing. What do you say? It's cooler than anything. I'm recording you right now. You're recording me? I'm recording you. And then we got the question of the day. If you could bring back any animal back from the extinction, what would it be? I would go with the dodo bird or a T-Rex. Super cool. Oh, gee. That was amazing. It's too hot. It's really it's nice too hot. cool in there. I asked the uh, archaeologist, or the paleontologist, the guy doing the digging, uh, how they came to discover that. Apparently in the 70s, two kids were running by the ravine in the distance here, saw a bone sticking out, no reported way. it, yep. And then they dug, they followed the bone, came across a number of other mammoth bodies or mammoth bones they don't know why they accumulated in that area whether or not they came there to die or water washed their corpses into that area the guy sits there all day five days a week trying to dig out the dirt in between the bones and he's going to leave it in the matrix because it's cooler to look at and it's more interesting to study and it provides certain answers that you can't provide if you take it out of the matrix that being the, the rock okay